In this video, we are going to learn how to create and customize a pie chart in Word. Hello, my name is Mark and you are watching the Office Master tutorial. Office Master is here to help you learn how to use Microsoft Office in quick and simple step-by-step -step tutorials. Charts are used in situations where a simple table won't adequately demonstrate important relationships or patterns between data points. Pie charts can be helpful for showing the relationship of individual parts to the whole. They are often used in business, for example, to display the percentage of revenue from various products and profits from various countries. In previous tutorials, we learned how to make a bar chart and line chart. Here's how we're going to do so. First, navigate to the Insert tab in the Illustrations group and click the Chart button. In the Insert Chart dialog box, select the Pie tab. We can see that there are several graph design options to choose from. For instance, select the first Pie option and click the OK button. We can see that MS Word inserts the chart type we just selected. In the spreadsheet that appears, you can replace the default data with your own information. In this video tutorial, we are going to use the default data. Once you're finished, close the spreadsheet. Now let's see how to customize your chart more into your liking. The position of the graph inside the document can be adjusted in a very simple way. Click on a blank space inside the chart, select the Layout Options icon on the right and choose the layout option we want. We will select Tight under With Text Wrapping and will leave the option Move with Text checked. Now we click on a blank space inside the chart and move the chart in any direction by pressing the left mouse button. You can also adjust the size of the graph by clicking in any corner of the graph area and dragging one of the corner handles in any direction until the size is just as you want it. Let's move on to the editable parts of our chart. The title of the chart contains the caption Sales, which you can edit by clicking on the caption and typing your own title. In this video, we are going to name the chart Pie Chart. If you want to add or remove elements such as chart title, data labels, and legend, click on the blank space in the chart and select the Chart Elements button on the right. Add data labels by checking the box next to this option. The design and color of the chart can also be easily adjusted according to preference. To change the design of the chart, click on the blank space in the chart area, then navigate to the Chart Design tab and search for Chart Styles. Click on the drop-down arrow to see a list of options. To change the color of the chart, navigate to the Chart Design tab once again and search for the option Change Colors to select the desired color from a list. Last thing to remember, a chart in Word is dynamic, which means that if we change any data in the spreadsheet, it will also be displayed in the chart. If you have already closed the spreadsheet, you can easily reopen it and edit the source data by clicking on the blank space of the chart area. Navigate to the Chart Design tab, search for the Data Group, and click the Edit Data option. Word will automatically open the spreadsheet. For example, you can change the value of sales in third quarter from 1,4 to 2,4. We can see that the graph has automatically updated the value in its display. Important notice. If you have a lot of data to chart, you can create the chart in Excel and then copy it from Excel to Word. This is also the best way if the data changes regularly and if you want the chart to always reflect the latest numbers. In that case, when you copy the chart, you need to keep it linked to the original Excel file. If you found this tutorial helpful, reward us with a like. 
Is this your first time on our YouTube channel? We would be more than grateful to welcome you to our community. So hit the subscribe button to enjoy more of our videos and learn how to master Word. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.